Welcome back, everybody, to the Oaky Smoking Channel right here on a sunny day, beautiful day in Oklahoma. I've got my smaller 22-inch Blackstone out today, and I'm going to make a crunch wrap. Yeah, we're going to do it. We're going to put some onions, tomatoes, a little jalapenos, start off with some ground beef. Well, let's just get right to it. Got a little over a pound and a half of some hamburger meat, 85%. And I'm going to go ahead and add a little olive oil right in the center. I got this set to medium. Pop that right on there. Just going to go ahead and break this up. Got the big spatula out today. Haven't used this one in a while. And then I'm just going to go ahead and put some of my own SPG in here. This is just my own recipe that I make. I need to get me a better, uh, you know, SPG. I need to get me a little better uh, logo or something put on that one day. Go ahead and sprinkle this all up on here. It's not coming out quite good enough. Let's get the good side. There we go. Let that cook till there's no more pink in it. Then I'm gonna add a little taco seasoning to it and um, cook it up. Then we're just gonna go ahead and throw the tortillas on, build this wrap. Probably hear a plane flying overhead right next to an Air Force base, so. think we're there so now I'm gonna add some taco seasoning as I always say though I've got the original taco bell but make it how you like it this is how I like it and we're gonna add some taco bell seasoning whole pack I'm just going to grab a little bowl and pour it right in here. Just let that set right there. And now I've got, man, I've got a jumbo sized uh, tortilla here. And like a lot of things I do, I haven't tried this before, so first time right now. I'm gonna throw that here. And that's getting that's getting hot. Let's set this over here. And just gonna place some of this meat right in the center of this jumbo tortilla like that a bit of cheese sauce we're just gonna pour on here a little bit of nacho cheese I'll throw one tostito right on top throw some of this on start off with a little lettuce that I shredded up put it all on that tostito right there if you watch this channel at all you know I like things a little spicy how about some jalapenos I do have the seeds removed so we're not going over the top some tomatoes, and a little picante sauce. Oh yeah. So now we just gotta grab this tortilla, which is very warm right now. So you probably should build the tortilla and then put it on here. I'll be eating that in a minute, but we're gonna set it aside. 
Okay, so we decided to take this assembly for this crunch wrap indoors. We got the cooked meat here, and we're going to redo this. So we're going to go ahead and put a little meat right on the center of this tortilla. Then we got the uh, nacho cheese that we microwaved. We're going to put that right on the hamburger meat. Add the tostada. Tost tostada. Tostada. <laughs> tostada. 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 Right on top. Okay, then we're going to do lettuce. We're going to add lettuce. Tostada. Lettuce. Um, I'll do tomatoes. Tomatoes next. Onions. Onions right here going in. Jalapenos. And jalapenos. Gotta have them spicy today. Gotta have the spice. Now we're going to add the sour, uh, cream. sour cream. And then we top it with another tortilla. And top it with one more. Then we take the sauce. So we dip the spatula in it. And you just kind of go around. Go around the top. Now it's time to fold. Okay. Got to do fa this part face down. Okay, face down, first. right on there. There yep. we go. Okay, I had Dolores help me out in uh, getting that built, so be sure to take it. I don't know what I was thinking. I built it right on the hot grill, then you could not fold it. But we're going to let that cook for a minute. And then we're going to flip it. And then we're going to have a crunch wrap. I actually have the other one that I messed up on rewrapped. Let me bring that out. So this is the one that uh, I was trying to build earlier and we just put a new tortilla and all the ingredients that I'd put on it out here uh, so we didn't waste anything. We're going to set that there and go ahead and cook that also. It's going to be fine. Same ingredients, just redone on a new tortilla, basically. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> Messed up. Dolores helped. So let's crank this up to about medium. Oh, you got a keto. I don't, I don't to have the crunchiness. Okay, you're gonna like put it. Mine's not a. gonna put that right like there. Little guy. Got the little keto version <laughs> coming on here. All right. All right. Here's my wife's keto version that she made with some keto. This is a low carb tortilla. Then the other two. And one those are of, actually zero carbs. Zero carbs. carbs okay. And one of these is the ones we did <laughs> inside, and the other one's the one that I did outside, brought back outside. I, I mixed them up. But we're going to cut into one of these. I think, which one you want to cut into? How about well, this? Well, you're the one that's going to eat it, so. Okay, let me go ahead and do this one. Got a good crunch on that tortilla. Wow. It looks good. It smells good too. I'm actually going to cut me another little piece off. No? Okay, okay. Here we go. Hmm. Wow. It's really, really good. That's really good. Seasoning. Mm -hmm. You want to try yours? Yeah. Here, go ahead and grab it. Let's see what yours looks like in there. This is the keto version. Good. Keto, and we got the regular. Better than Taco Bell. 
Yeah, I agree there. I was thinking the same thing. That's definitely beat the Taco Bell crunch wrap. That's really good. Just throw them ingredients on your Blackstone, cook your meat up, throw some seasoning in there, put it in your tortilla, that tostado, uh, tostada. <laughs> Can't ever say that. Uh, but hey, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Of course, make it how you like it. This is how we like it. Cheers.